After the baby basically flopped with his album selling, what did he sell? Like 17K, it was under 20, he sold less than Lucky. And Lucky is like a certified underground artist, right? Although I feel like he's he's not in there anymore. He's in purgatory. He's finally clawed himself out of the hole he's in. If y'all have watched that uh, Barbarian movie on Netflix or HBO, whatever it is on, if you watch it, it gets crazy. You see nasty old titties by a sad savage woman and she makes she makes the people stuck in her hole in her her cave breastfeed out of her nasty like i don't even know if that's milk it's probably expired but anyway so lucky got out of that shit whereas the baby he got stuck in the hole now he loki went from mainstream to underground so what's happening with the baby is people are speculating that he is selling tickets for like buy one get one free now let's see so i don't know what site this is eventbrite it looks like general admission 22 dollars to 42 dollars depending on like general admission slash vip or whatever probably or no no it's standing and then one's probably seated so you get like the floor and it says bogo <laughs> general admission so you can get one for your boy for free you know, if you swing in that way, I would say he fell off because his numbers are definitely not doing well. But at the same time, we're in a recession. Like, I don't know if people are going to see artists right now. Plus, it's like winter. So he's just trying to get the honestly, it's better to profit less when you perform and fill out the stadium or fill out the venue. So the marketing seems good because that'll make you more money later on. Because the last thing you want is like a smoke perp situation for it to be empty because you're charging too much or you're not giving away free tickets or whatever. Right? Does anybody agree with that? What's happening to the baby is what Twitter swears is happening to Uzi. I think Uzi's numbers are there. Nobody really thinks that he's fallen off that way. I think they're just talking about like the quality. And I don't think he really sounds the same as he once did. Whereas the baby, the complaint is like he hasn't evolved as an artist whatsoever. And also the baby's been like canceled and shit. So he he basically alienated all of the the homosexuals, the LGBTQ. They ain't buying tickets to this shit because obviously the baby demographic they probably ain't fucking with them either so they might go uh see the baby and some shit might go down i don't know um also like the baby's just gonna perform the same song for like an hour but i was talking about like the recession at the same time there are other artists who no matter what the landscape of the economic and political state is they would still go the fans would still go see like i'm sure cardi fans would still go see him uzi fans would still go see him even trippy fans it's definitely the baby's time to get out of here i feel like you need to fall off gracefully and this goes for anybody any any industry like just if you're fading a little bit just take a step back plan things out more thoroughly when you come back but like right now when you drop a project and it only sells 17k maybe that's an indication that you shouldn't go on tour and try and sell tickets maybe you just get your advance money and go home and invest that shit in the s p 500 because stocks are down so in five years you'll probably make more money that way than if you go on tour and then they take pictures of nobody in your venue because you're having to do buy one get one free you might as well just not it might as well be like a marketing event where you let people in for free like yeet did back in the day and it was crazy marketing because it was like oh my god it got overpacked, and then the police had to come and oh then he couldn't even perform it's like these artists don't want to perform anyway right <laughs> they just want to make the money now nah, some of them do